Hello, welcome back to Kerno EXP and welcome to the centre of Pool in between Camborne and Red Roof. Today we're heading over to Heartlands and Wheel Palmer to have a little look. We're staying quite close to HQ because the weather has gone pants. We've already had our mobile HQ destroyed last night in heavy wind. So I'm here with Mrs. Kerno EXP. Mrs. Kerno EXP. And we're going to look around Heartlands and Wheel Palmer and a bit of South Crofty. Let's go, shall we, folks? All right, you ready? Get ready. Hang on a minute. Three, two, one, go. All righty. So this is just ahead of Storm Kathleen, isn't it? Yeah. And uh, there's meant to be really high winds coming in. That's why me and Mrs. Kernow briefly earlier went over to where our mobile HQ is and uh, it, it blew away about 100 metres, well, didn't it? it oh, bloody hell. Yeah, we can't say where that is but for obvious reasons, but it just got destroyed, didn't it? Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So we, well, I think there is some salvageable parts there, folks, but we will buy one again, the same, and that will ensure that we've got some parts. So the chimney, you can see, that's Wheel Palmer and Bickford's. So that's where we're going to go in right now. And uh, the wind is still quite high, but the drone we're using today will just eat it up, hopefully. So that's good. I don't know, I don't like it. Funky, funky wall here, isn't it, folks? Look at that. Definitely different, isn't it? Right, so this is part of the Heartlands uh, area. And uh, I think Heart I've been told by a member of the crew that Heartland might have a f reprieve. So that's good news. So we shall see what happens with that. It would be nice if it does come back. Touch wood. Hey, mouse. Right, so this is uh, Palmer's and Bickford's shaft mine. And uh, we're going to get to the point where we like to go and go from there. So the shaft, I believe, because there's this frame over here, which we'll have a little look at. It's got the original capstan wheel still on it, Jen, which is absolutely amazing because it doesn't always happen. Where is it to? There it is. There you go, folks. Look. Can you see that? Does it turn? Oh, bloody hell, it does turn still. Amazing, isn't it? Right, okay, so that's where the boiler was for this particular engine, this little winder. So we'll follow. Mrs. Kernay. No, we won't. We'll go our own path. Look, we beat her. We've beat her. Look. <laughs> right. Okay. So there's lots of uh, mining related ruins around here, folks. Um, all connected to South Crofty in one form or another. So we're near Robinson's shaft which was where the men used to go up and down. And uh, here we've got uh, some other very ancient looking remains just there. Used to be able to go in there, but uh, they fenced it off basically to stop uh, from it from being vandalized by idiots, basically. So yeah, right -o. So we'll be back in a bit, folks. We'll continue our little walk further down. Anyway, see you in a So we're making our way into Heartlands now, me and Mrs. Kernow. We're pretty confident we can get the drone up today and uh, we've got it in sports mode, folk. So that'd be quite good. So, haven't been down here since it officially closed, which is a while back, isn't it? So, don't really know what's going on, but I've been told that it may open again, so let's hope it does because um, history is important, folks, and uh, there's nothing else around Camborne Red Roof, really, 
apart from uh, towns and stuff and what have you, and yeah, whatever, <laughs> and whatever, isn't it? But uh, anyway, let's uh, have a look and see what has changed, if anything. So we don't really know, but uh, ooh, it's just felt a bit of a wet stuff then, which is not terribly good. So this might be a quick little flick around. Might be a quick flick around, folks. So Robinson Shaft was part of South Crofty Mine, which closed in 1998. And this is where the men used to get washed and changed at this location here. Now, the engine house, which is right here, is called Robinson's. This was a pumping engine house. And it was the very last engine to ever work in Cornwall. To work commercially, that is. So I think it would be rude not to have a little nosy through the door. Now, last time we did that, it didn't look very good. It looked a bit tired, which... Uh, kind of known that for a while to be fair but um, anyway let's have a little look let's have a little nosy and as we can see it's uh, I don't know if you can see that no probably not hang on there you go that's better isn't it so it's still the same basically but no power on or anything like that where's Mrs Kerno down there look hello hello <laughs> right let's uh, let's walk around the site here. Let's go this way, shall we? <clears throat> it is rather windy. It's the day before the storm, folks. Storm Catherine. Which I think is going to be not so good, isn't it? Yeah, I think we're all fed up with that. Right, okay, so we've got the internal tramway system here. And then, obviously, we've got the head frame, which we've, we're going to fly over the top of that in a bit. And uh, over here, we've got, um, inside of this shed here, this little shed is this little steam winder, which we've seen. And uh, this wire rope here is the capstan. And that originally would have went through the window there and in, into the winder down below, which, uh, it's still in good order now, so you can't really... Unfortunately, we can't get in there, folks, but that's where the winder is or was. And as you can see, look, the winder rope is still there, which goes up to the capstan wheel, which is partially still still connected, which is awesome to see that. Um, so this building here was the calf at one time. Uh, before that, originally it was built as a saw, there, what there is, I don't know if it's still there now, but there was a big saw in there and that's where they would have cut the uh, pit props for the mine in that, which is quite interesting. So I think what we'll do now is we'll just uh, walk down here along the track. Going along the track, folks. Oh, oh. Imagine it being a steam train. Toot toot. All right. I think what they should have done with this track is got more of it and connected it up and have little little, little wagon rides. Yeah. That would be good, wouldn't it? <laughs> Make it more of a better museum. So we've got more track there. So this would have carried on. Possibly would have connected into that at the same stage. But the sawmill, folks, the saw would have been in one of these buildings here. Now, um... I'm not sure, I think it might have been this building here actually. It should say on it. Yeah, I'm right, look, there you go, look. Sawmill, the sawmill, can you see that? Yeah, told you, didn't I? And that's where they, when the timber would have been cut, there would have been a doors here, and they would have rolled them out on this, and then lorry would have came in and taken them away to another site. Right, come on then, Jenny. <clears throat> right, we're gonna walk around the other way now. <coughs> Excuse me, mind the white rope track, sorry. <laughs> Electric compressor. So that's the compressors in there. That's right, good, eh? 
So, anyway, so I'm not really sure what that building was. Probably a generator or something along those lines. Could be, couldn't it? Yeah. Period correct, mind that trip hazard there. Does it say what this was? Substation. Ah, this is the substation, folks. This is electric. They, look at those windows, look. Do they look original or what? Wow. Okay, right. We'll walk around here. This is, was the former museum, folks, which was open to the public, and we're hoping that uh, it does get this reprieve. Because if it gets the reprieve, then that's awesome for the local area, isn't it, Jen? Yeah. yeah. Right, so we're coming to the end of this bit of video now, so I hope you enjoyed it. We've braved the weather, haven't we? Oh. Eh? Mm -hmm. And uh, now I think we'll be back out on Monday now, or Tuesday, or even Wednesday. So videos will slow down a bit next week because we've got work commitments for a bit. Okay. But during the afternoons we haven't, have we? No. So that's good. Registration office. Oh, I wonder who is in there. Doesn't it just? Yeah. Right, so we'll just get up here and then uh, me and Mrs. Kerner will say goodbye to you. Yeah? You're right. Yeah? <laughs> okay, so you go this side, minute. All right, stay here. Stay here. Right, so thanks for watching folks. Uh, this is Heartlands again, another update video. There is going to be a drone flight after this, so hang, hunker on down. Uh, batten down the hatches tonight folks and tomorrow because we've got storm coming in. So anyway, from me and Mrs Kerner, we bid you farewell. See you next time. Cheers.